If you or someone you care about is living with diabetes, it's crucial to be aware of how dietary choices can impact health. High sodium intake is particularly risky for diabetics, so let's dive into the specifics of which foods to watch out for and why. First on our list are processed meats. This category includes bacon, sausage, ham, deli meats, hot dogs, and pepperoni. These foods are popular for their convenience and taste, but are notorious for their high sodium content. Processed meats are often loaded with salt to enhance flavor and extend shelf life. Unfortunately, for diabetics, this means an increased risk of hypertension or high blood pressure. According to a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, high sodium intake is directly linked to elevated blood pressure, which in turn can exacerbate the risk of cardiovascular diseases, a common concern for those with diabetes. Additionally, processed meats often contain unhealthy fats and preservatives like nitrates and nitrites, which have been linked to further health complications, including insulin resistance. Next, let's talk about canned soups and vegetables. These are kitchen staples for many, thanks to their long shelf life and ease of preparation. However, what many don't realize is that these items often contain high amounts of added salt. Take canned tomato soup, for example. It's comforting and delicious, but a single serving can contain nearly half of the recommended daily sodium intake. Research from the Journal of Hypertension highlights that excessive sodium intake from sources like canned foods can lead to increased blood pressure and kidney strain. This is particularly problematic for diabetics who already have a higher risk of developing kidney disease. Salty snacks are another major culprit. Items like potato chips, pretzels, popcorn, and salted nuts are ubiquitous at parties and gatherings, and it's easy to consume them mindlessly. However, these snacks are often laden with sodium and unhealthy fats. A study from the New England Journal of Medicine found that a diet high in salty snacks can contribute significantly to weight gain and hypertension. For diabetics, maintaining a healthy weight is crucial for managing blood sugar levels and reducing the risk of complications. Therefore, reaching for these salty snacks can set off a chain reaction of negative health outcomes. Frozen dinners and processed foods are incredibly convenient, especially for those with busy lifestyles. These include frozen pizzas, microwavable meals, and TV dinners. However, convenience often comes at the cost of nutritional value. These foods are typically high in sodium to preserve flavor and ensure a longer shelf life. A comprehensive review published in the Journal of the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics points out that high sodium levels in these meals can lead to cardiovascular issues and poor blood sugar control. Moreover, the added preservatives and artificial ingredients can further complicate diabetes management. Pickles and olives are often seen as healthy additions to meals due to their probiotic content and low calorie count. However, the pickling process involves soaking these foods in a brine solution rich in salt. As a result, pickles and olives can contain a surprisingly high amount of sodium. According to research in the Journal of Food Science, the high sodium content in pickled foods can contribute to elevated blood pressure and fluid retention, both of which are problematic for diabetics. While they can be enjoyed in moderation, it's essential to be mindful of portion sizes and consider low-sodium versions when possible. Cheese and dairy products are next on our list. While dairy can be a good source of calcium and protein, many cheeses, especially processed varieties like American cheese slices, cottage cheese, and cheese spreads are high in sodium. A study from the American Heart Association indicates that high sodium intake from dairy products can contribute to increased blood pressure and heart disease risk. For diabetics who already face a higher likelihood of cardiovascular complications, it's wise to choose low sodium or reduced fat options when consuming dairy. Now, saving the best for last, let's focus on condiments and sauces. These often fly under the radar when we think about high-sodium foods, but they can be significant contributors to overall sodium intake. Soy sauce, ketchup, barbecue sauce, and salad dressings are prime examples. These items are frequently used to add flavor to meals, but even small amounts can pack a hefty sodium punch.
Research from the British Medical Journal shows that condiments and sauces can contribute to a substantial portion of daily sodium intake, which can easily lead to the recommended daily limit being surpassed. For diabetics, this can mean an increased risk of hypertension and its associated complications. Understanding the impact of sodium on diabetes management requires delving into how sodium interacts with various bodily systems. For diabetics, the relationship between sodium intake and insulin resistance is particularly concerning. A study published in Diabetes Care revealed that excessive sodium consumption could worsen insulin resistance, making it more challenging for diabetics to control their blood glucose levels. This is because high sodium levels can lead to increased levels of certain hormones like aldosterone, which negatively affect insulin sensitivity. Furthermore, the American Diabetes Association points out that high sodium intake can exacerbate the already increased risk of cardiovascular disease among diabetics. The link between sodium and hypertension is well documented, and for individuals with diabetes, maintaining optimal blood pressure is critical to prevent complications such as heart attacks and strokes. Kidney function is another area where high sodium intake poses significant risks. The kidneys are vital in regulating sodium and fluid balance in the body, but diabetes can impair kidney function, leading to conditions like diabetic nephropathy. Consuming high-sodium foods can accelerate kidney damage by increasing blood pressure and fluid retention, placing additional strain on already compromised kidneys. The CDC reports that reducing sodium intake can significantly lower the risk of developing end-stage renal disease among diabetics. Additionally, high sodium levels can cause the body to retain excess fluid, which can lead to swelling and discomfort, further complicating diabetes management. By understanding these intricate relationships between sodium intake and diabetic health, it's clear why minimizing sodium consumption is crucial. Focusing on a diet low in sodium not only helps manage diabetes more effectively, but also reduces the risk of severe health complications, thereby improving overall quality of life for those living with diabetes. In conclusion, being aware of high-sodium foods is crucial for managing diabetes effectively. The dangers these foods pose are not to be taken lightly as they can significantly impact blood pressure, cardiovascular health, kidney function, and overall diabetes management. Processed meats, canned soups and vegetables, salty snacks, frozen dinners and processed foods, pickles and olives, cheese and dairy products, and condiments and sauces all share the common trait of being high in sodium and thus potentially harmful for diabetics. Making informed dietary choices is essential. Opting for fresh, whole foods whenever possible, cooking at home to control salt content, reading food labels carefully, and using herbs and spices to enhance flavor instead of relying on salt are all strategies that can help manage sodium intake. Additionally, choosing low-sodium versions of favorite foods and condiments can make a significant difference. It's also important to stay informed and regularly consult with healthcare providers to monitor blood pressure and kidney function. Diabetes management is a lifelong journey that involves making daily choices that promote overall health and well-being. By understanding and avoiding high-sodium foods, diabetics can take a proactive step toward better health and a more manageable condition.